Minneapolis hopes a new project on the history of North Minneapolis becomes the talk of the town. And the city has collected dozens of oral histories to celebrate stories of resistance and resilience there. Maury Glover has that story. The corner of Plymouth and Penn Avenues has been at the heart of the black community on the city's north side for decades. Now the histories of the people who live in the neighborhood surrounding the well-known intersection are taking center stage. We've been trying to do this work for a very, very long time. I'm really excited that it's culminated. I live on the north side. Over the last couple of years, the city of Minneapolis's Division of Race and Equity collected oral histories from 90 community elders for the North Side Oral History Project. It then commissioned four artists to turn those tales of life in North Minneapolis over the last 50 years into works of art, including a short film featuring spoken word poetry that premiered via Zoom Monday night. Oral history within the black community has really long, uh, a really long trajectory. It is a cultural thing stemming from our prior to coming to the United States as enslaved people. Um, hundreds of years ago, like that was a tradition of the way that we communicated and transmitted knowledge. The city chose to focus on Plymouth and Penn because it's been the site of so many historic events of the last half century. From the Plymouth Avenue riots in the late 60s to the shooting of Jamar Clark and the occupation of the 4th Precinct that followed just a few years ago in the hope of building more trust between city leaders and members of the community. It is our birthright to stay. It is our duty to find a way. In the end, organizers hope looking at North Minneapolis's past will help move it towards a brighter future. Celebrating how community has also, in spite of some of the negative rap that North Minneapolis is celebrating the fact that this has been a community that has worked really hard to push and move itself forward, really wanting to shine a light on how people have done that over the last 50 years. Maury Glover, Fox 9 News.